We are in continuous effort to look for habitable environment on Mars. But the extreme conditions on Mars like high winds, extremely low temperature and sand dunes, are the major challenges that the scientists and the rovers have to overcome. In this video I will tell you how NASA's Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter have found out the remains of two NASA's rover that got stuck on the red planet. So, stay tuned with us in this short new journey to know how the dead spacecraft on Mars has been spotted in striking new images. The Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter has been circling the red planet since 2006. The spacecraft has been mounted with many high-resolution cameras that help to identify many strange objects on Mars. While spying around the red planet, the probe identified the remains of two probes that also landed on Mars. With the help of its higher resolution imaging science experiment camera, the spacecraft identified Phoenix Mars lander in the Martian Arctic zone, while it was the second year of the demise probe on the red planet. In this color photograph taken by the probe, the Phoenix Mars lander can be seen by the bright spots in the image. The Phoenix lander was launched to search and dig for the evidence of water in the Vestitas Borealis Plains in the Martian Arctic. It stayed for six months on the planet and confirmed the presence of subsurface water ice and made valuable characterizations of Martian dirt. Unfortunately, the rover stopped working when the spacecraft stopped receiving adequate power due to a combination of dwindling sunlight, light obscuring dust and harsh winter temperatures. In another photo, the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter spotted the three-pedal landing platform, which delivered the NASA's Spirit rover on the red planet. This platform was actually a combination of parachute and airbags that helped the rover to bounce on the surface at the Gusev crater and begin its mission. In this MRO image, we can see the Spirit's platform at the bottom left, appearing as bright spot in the southwest of Bonneville crater. The rover went silent in 2010, when the NASA's official declared the rover is dead. This was only because of the orbiter's higher resolution camera that helped to take this wonderful colored image. All the credit for this colorful stunning images goes to the NASA's Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter that was launched primarily to search for ancient environment and how processes such as wind, meteorite impacts and seasonal frosts are continuing to affect the surface of Mars today. Hope you enjoyed this short little journey with us. If you liked our video, then hit the like button and subscribe our channel to see more amazing and interesting videos for you. See you soon.